Hi guys, it's Megan. So today I'm doing my January 2015 favorites for you guys. I don't feel like I have very much stuff, but let's just go ahead and get into it. So the first thing that I have to show you guys is the foundation that I'm wearing right now, and it's Revlon's Color Stay. Um, everybody has heard about this and knows about it. Just recently this month, I have been breaking out like crazy, and this is a very good full coverage foundation. So I've been wearing this to try to help hide my blemishes. They're very pigmented though so sometimes there's not very much I can do but I'm trying and this is the combination to oily skin one and it is in ivory the next thing that I have to show you guys is two separate lip colors um, the first one is the one that I'm wearing right now and again it's from Revlon that's weird uh, but it's their gloss in pink whisper and yes this is the old packaging uh, but like I said I'm wearing it right now it's just a really pretty just a very pretty pink color. And this is also from Revlon and it's their Super Lustrous Lipstick in Certainly Red. And if you watched my Bath and Body Works haul, um, I was wearing this lipstick. So I'll just do a quick swatch. I really, really love this lipstick. It's a really pretty red. The next thing I have to show you guys is an eyeliner, and I've wore this all month. I did not pick up another one besides this one, and it's the Maybelline Master Precise by Eye Studio, the one that looks like a lot. You can get the finest line ever on this. It's just, it's really great. It's very black, and it's really great for just putting it really close to the lash line because it's just so precise. I really recommend this for people that have hooded eyes like I do because it just makes it very easy to get right to the lash line without like covering my eyelid shade. This next thing I've also wore the entire month of January. The only eyeshadow that I've worn and I've used it in different ways but it's the Natural Smokes Eyeshadow Quad. It looks like this. So today I'm wearing the lid shade on my eyelid and then I'm wearing the crease and also the brow bone color but just depending on what look I'm going for sometimes I wear it you know just as it says this to do or I just kind of switch it up and do whatever I want with it and then lastly for makeup products um, I've been using this BH Cosmetics 10 color <laughs> blush palette basically all month as well um, it has beautiful beautiful colors very pigmented very soft and smooth 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 and today i'm wearing this color right here i really love this there's a whole bunch of different colors and i got this from hot look so or hope look whatever you want to call it so they're on there pretty often if you want to look into bh cosmetics or obviously they have their own website as well so now i move on to some random favorites and my first random favorite i just had to get off my foot because it is these slippers. Um, I got these from Target like a couple months ago, but I live in these. I'm not even joking. I, unless I go somewhere, obviously. But um, there has been times where I went to uh, the cancer treatment center and just worn my house shoes because they're just so comfortable. And they have the cute little fuzzies, um, but they have started to like wear out because I wear them so much. But they're just they're amazing they're gray which is the color for brain cancer so that's even better this next thing um, is from Target and it was like five dollars I think and it's just this little speaker um, you, you know, turn it on and off and it runs on three triple-a batteries and I love this every time I'm cooking or cleaning I just hook my iPod onto this or um, my phone and just jam out to some music and like I said it's five dollars very cheap so I get a ton of use out of this and they still have them so they have different colors as well you don't have to get the white one I think they have like a pink one or a black I don't know all kinds of different colors For Christmas Jared got me a Keurig and it's a Keurig K40 I think I've tried quite a few different brands of K cups but I love this one guys you have to try it if you have a Keurig or anything that holds Keurig cups, whatever. It's the Gloria Jeans coffees and this is the macadamia cookie. Guys, oh my gosh, this is like heaven in a cup. 
hands down my favorite flavor that I've tried. I've tried also brown sugar cake and the cinnamon roll one, but this one is so good. Like I'm going to have this always. Like I, I can't be without this. And then my last favorite is nothing that I can show you because it's on Netflix. I finished this back in December, but I didn't do a favorites video then, so I haven't been able to talk to you guys about it. But it is One Tree Hill. I love One Tree Hill. I love. I have like a major girl crush on Sophia Bush. You have no idea. Previously, I had finished Dawson's Creek, and I like Dawson's Creek, but I feel like One Tree Hill just was more mature or dealt a lot more with um, different issues that kids go through and it's just more more realistic I guess I could say like instead of doing one season like per year they did like they halved it they did one season like season one is like the first semester of um, their high school and then the second season is like the second semester so I like how they did that because you got to fit a lot more in fast forwarded through four years and they just s skipped the whole college and everything which totally makes sense because you know everyone was going to different places and it just made sense because who they you know never said that they were going to go anywhere together so I like that they just like met back after the four years and I just felt like this like it took a little bit to get used to it at first because you know they went from being in high school and then all of a sudden they went through college that you didn't get to see and then here they are like 21 22 year old adults i would just highly recommend that show i love it it's one of my all-time favorites now all right guys so that's all the favorites that i wanted to show you guys um if you have any recommendations suggestions comments or anything leave them down below and thanks as always for watching and i'll talk to you guys next time bye